What is up everybody? My name is Advance and this is Advance Sports Talk. Keep the fit. You know, I had to break out the had to break out the goat. <laughs> had the Capricorn t-shirt for the goat. <laughs> well, Baker's not the goat. He's not the goat, but for taking over for the goat, didn't do such a bad job. First season, second season with the Bucks, already off to a good start. I figured we was gonna avenge that Lions loss from the playoffs last year. I'm sorry, I saw they they had us as seven point underdogs. I said, oh no, I gotta put some money on that. So we won the game by a whisker. But hey, whether it's by an inch or by a mile, you know what Dominic Toretto says. Winning is winning. The Lions pass rush was vicious now, you know they their backs or their, their um their uh, rushers just happened to kept finding their way in the backfield and it wasn't even really their defense or their pass rush it was just Aiden Hutchinson that dude is a beast definitely a monster like every time I saw Baker go down or somebody gets sacked or or whether Baker got sacked or one of our running backs got tackled in the backfield I'm like, damn, who was it? Damn, him again? <laughs> Definitely got tired of hearing Aiden Hutchinson's name throughout that whole game. That, but that's only because, you know, he was playing against us. But no, all in all, it's a good game. I didn't think that it was going to be that close. Um, well, no, I expected us to win. I didn't think that, I probably thought we was going to win by like three. I didn't think we was going to have to pull it out at the last second or pull it out by one. <laughs> And thing is that we almost pissed it away because after we stopped them, well, I was like, oh, oh, we good. We good, we got this. Oh, all right, all we gotta do is run the clock out. And then I turned around and saw that they was back on the field. <laughs> I was like, oh shit. <laughs> but hey, like I always say, defense shows up. Mike Evans, took a bit of a back seat this week or this past week and you know like it like it all like always you know it's it, it's it's the same thing every year one week it could be Mike Evans the next week it could be Chris Godwin sometimes Mike Evans goes off two weeks in a row sometimes Chris Godwin goes off two weeks in a row so hey it's par for the course but we got Denver coming up so uh yeah they 0-2 right now but once again, I'm not, a, I'm never underestimate. So yeah, not underestimating, not, a, not a person. <laughs> so, you know, they got that, that rookie, Bo Nix. You know, any rookie quarterback is liable to go off at any time. So I just hope it's not about, it's not against us. Now, chances are that probably won't happen because we're still early in the season. Rookies are still adjusting to playing in the NFL but we'll see. But in any case, that's just me. Th th those are my thoughts. What are your thoughts? Put your thoughts in the comment section down below. Let's chop it up. All right, on to week three. Denver Broncos country. Get rid. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. I, I, I work on one, I work on one.